Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto, here with a new Let's Play for my channel. This is Momodora, Reverie Under the Moonlight. Anyway, let's see, let's get into this, enough announcements. As you can see, I've played this game a bunch of times. Uh, I love this game, it's one of the best games on Steam that I've played uh, and beaten a bunch of times. Um, so... What was I gonna was I gonna say something? Oh, I was talking about this game. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm really tired. Uh, I haven't been getting much sleep lately. I got my controller to work on this though, which is good. Uh, I've tried a few takes of this. Um, I think we're gonna play on easy and just be a little bit of a sellout here because you get not only do you get way more health and defense and invincibility for frames because you get these two I you get another you get two items that one of them slowly heals you one of them gives you more defense and invincibility frames and those will be really useful because I don't need to be dying left and right <laughs> uh, I, I want this to be a nice chill time where we're not having to keep going back and die I mean I could have that stuff out but uh, we're just gonna kind of go with the flow in a way I guess you could say, I'm afraid this is as far as I can take you. I'm sorry, anything close to the city is too dangerous. Surely that, that shouldn't be a problem for a priestess like you. Fighting using a leaf must be difficult. But I have faith in your ability to seal the curse away. It has spread to your land too, after all. For now, maybe the best you can do is seek an audience with our queen. So you don't actually fight with what looks like a lame leaf thing, you'll see. The animation sprites for it are actually really cool, see, look, it's like a sword, hells yeah. This is a bellflower, uh, basically what that does is, yeah, these are the items I was talking about. You have metal equivalents and adorned ring. The adorned ring gives you a passive effect of increasing your invisibility frames and defense. It's manually sculpted from minerals found in the depths of the Green River. The piece comes from a Middle Western Empire, evident by its engraving. The metal equivalents uh, slowly restores your HP. Metal from the province of Chrominia, carried by messengers mounted on deers, dedicated to a life of long travels. And the bellflower uh, is basically gives you health. Yeah. <laughs> so a small amount of HP per use. Sour flower with restorative powers. Restorative powers. Yeah. Um, you could play this uh, as a, and get a pacifist trophy or something. I don't know if you get like a special ending or what. I've never played it that way. It's just more fun to enjoy the action, I guess you can say. Bells to save progress and restore your items. I have to hit it once. But I, don't know, I thought that would be fun. Did I? No, I don't think so. Hang on, I have to go back and check. No. Shoot. Um, I think I'm gonna miss something, but I guess we'll just keep going and find out later. This person, you have to roll behind them. The game told you how to roll in order to defeat them. That's poison that she's shooting out. You don't want to get hit by that, or else it won't be fun. Oh, crap. That's like a bunch of money right there. Oh, well. I got... I guess that's an easy mode exclusive thing, because I didn't see it. But I tried taking a, doing a couple takes of this before.
We got a hidden room here. That's a vitality fragment. It'll increase your HP. So I chose to play on easy mode. I don't know if I explained this yet or not. Because I kind of just want this let's play slash kind of walk through. Be just kind of like chill vibes. Basically. And not have to... Oh yeah, I did explain that. I think. Did I? I, I, I well, I'll say it again if I didn't. I'm sorry if I already said this, but uh, I just kind of want it to be like a chill vibes, kind of flow, not dying a million times kind of game, kind of let's play. Yeah. All right. Okay. So that. Charm, not the only one in the game. <laughs> uh, you use that to be able to uh, have enemies occasionally drop a lot more money. Here, I'll read what it says. Sometimes enemies will drop twice as much money. An old worn out charm radically increases your luck. I took off the adorned ring, which is the thing that increases your invincibility frames of defense. I'm gonna keep the thing that solely restores your HP though, for now. Yeah, that, that poison cloud there, it lingers for a little bit and can still poison you, so you gotta watch out for that. Oh, this is what I was thinking of earlier. Good, I didn't have to go back. So this is an ivory bug. There's 20 in the game randomly throughout the whole game everywhere. Uh, you get them all. You get some kind of special item that I don't remember what it is right now. I think, or something. Which is cool, obviously. Uh, so we're going to try to get all those. Uh, ooh, 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 yeah. <laughs> this little bee-looking spider dude, bee spider guy, um, he is a monster and you can hit him and attack him, but I would suggest not doing that because if you leave him alone and you just let him come down and say hi to you, later in the game he will uh, be like a merchant and he'll sell you some cool items and stuff, which is epic. And some of the items he says, or says, sells, or at least one of them, uh, is extremely rare and that it's the only way, buying it from him is the only way you can get it, so. I would highly suggest not hitting that guy. I've got another Vitality Fragment here. Cool. Oh, shiz. Yep, got poison. That's okay. We're playing on easy. Not to worry about stuff anymore. Like that, I guess. I have no business with you. Go away, you stupid girl. Okay. A hidden room there. I think you can come back and talk to her or something and get something maybe. I wonder if they respond when you come back. I can't remember. Yep, they do. Okay. Well, I'm gonna find you again. Another ivory bug, obviously. Hmm, 
can't go this way yet. Okay. I think we're about to face against the first boss. Um, this will be fun, I guess you could say. If you, every boss in this game, if you can beat them without getting hit once, they drop a special item. Well, that sucks. the heck? How did I kill him? Well, that works. I wonder if it's because I died a bunch of times and I'm playing on easy. <laughs> oh well. Or maybe, like, he hits a certain spot where that fairy comes out, like right in the middle in a certain frame, and, uh, it just destroys all his health. I don't know. Either way, we, we got what we wanted, which was, uh, this. Um, if you, I don't know if I cut this out in the edit, but, because I died a bunch of times, uh, so I had to edit, I'm gonna have to edit a few things out, but, uh, as you can see here, this has a passive effect, grants poison properties to your arrows, Edia was a sinner who betrayed her own people, for such acts she was purged, and her body sent to a sacred grove far from home. Um, but yeah, if you... Kill the bosses. Each boss in this game has a special item they will drop and if you beat them without getting hit once. Which is why I was retrying that boss over and over again. Um, yeah, now we have no... Oh, wow, this is beautiful. I forgot about this. We're not going to have any of the easy items on for now. Uh, we're just gonna have the Eddie's Pearl and Astral, Astral Charm. I'm sorry, who are you? I see, so you are Kaho, huh? What a unique name. Call me Ascorn. I take it you are unaware of the situation of these lands. <laughs> I mentioned your journey brought you here in search of the Queen. If you really intend to continue further in the Kingdom of Karst, beware. The ghastly presence has been enveloping everything. This sacred grove is one of the few untouched spots. Say anything else? Coast City is ahead. The same as is now. I must visit it to search for a beloved one. <coughs> okay, so this is Car City. Um, yeah, really cool place. Obviously, it kind of looks like um, Castlevania-style area. Got another ivory bug. Yay! And this lady. Came from that imp infested forest? Hey, <laughs> interesting. How can I help you? Is a merchant. And if, to see the information about the items they sell, you just click on the item and choose whether or not to buy it, and it says what it does. Uh, this crystal seed active effect temporarily increases attack by 50%. Can be useful for bosses, obviously. Uh, raises user's status sale. The passive effect raises user's resistance to status ailments. That would be the fairy tier. And this is the Ring of Candor. Uh, emits a sound when near secrecy. We are going to get that, but I'm going to save for it for now. And I'm going to end this episode here. Have a great! Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto. And I am back with more Mamodara Reverie Under the Moonlight. Here with you guys. Yeah, um, so, 
Uh, check this out. I'm not going to be playing this file anymore. In fact, we're even going to delete it. Because check this out. This is my original file playing this game. As you can see, I played 13 hours, 17 minutes, and 20 seconds. And the cool thing about this game is, when you play it and beat it, you get to keep all the items that you got from your previous play if you play it again. And very conveniently, we are here on this. I'm here from the last time I tried to play this again. Or was going to play this again, or whatever. And I, I, this is where I stopped, so. See, I haven't even talked to this lady yet. You came from that infested forest. Hi, ha, ha, interesting. How can I help you? But I already have all these items, so I don't need to buy them. Uh, yeah, I have, I have everything. <laughs> um, and that's cool, obviously, because, um, now we can just fight the bosses without worrying about whether or not they're going to hit us. That's the main thing I want to not have to deal with. And now we can just kind of make things a little bit more, even more chill than they were when I was going to play, going to be when I was going to play it in easy mode. Uh... Because, uh, yeah. Alrighty then. So what I had equipped was quick arrows, which drastically increases the speed of your arrows to the point where you can't even see them coming out of the bow. <laughs> uh, but I don't want to use that right now. I'm going to use the uh, pocket incensory, which adds flame damage to your attacks. Uh, enchanted container filled with charcoal and incense. And I add the heavy arrows, increases the power of your arrows, but we're going to use the uh, drilling arrows instead which allows them to pierce through your enemies and I think other stuff too like their attacks and whatnot if the arrows normally stop on them supposed to type of arrow used by the archer of karst and yeah hang on um let me show you what this does Yeah, that's kind of stupidly overpowered, but that's what you get when you defeat the boss we're gonna fight without getting hit, which is pretty nice. But yay, past me I already did all that, so I don't have to worry about it anymore. <laughs> I'm sorry if that disappoints anyone that I'm doing it this way, uh, but I just, like I said before, I just want to play the game and not worry about dying and get, well, getting hit by bosses. and. I don't have to worry about not getting hit by bosses so I can unlock these items that I already have anyway, basically. <laughs> I guess that's what I'm saying. So we can do, now we can just enjoy the game and not worry about any of it. How many times can I repeat myself in different ways? Let me count the ways. <laughs> oh yeah, and as you can see, my leap is green because later in the game you unlock uh, a strong relief or something for your leaf, or something. Like a level 2 sword in Zelda. Or the Master Sword in Zelda, or whatever. Obviously we got, uh, there's a wolf down here, you wanna kill him because uh, I think there's like an ivory bug or something that you can get, maybe, I don't remember exactly. Um, hang on a second. Come on. And now we can just not worry about these two as much. Okay, you know what? I'm out of there. So this is one of the most useful uh, boss items you can get. This is called the Blessing Charm, and this is what it does. <laughs> Basically, I, I mean, it kind of explains itself. Oh, I knew there was a monster there. I'm just like, uh, can't go this way yet. So he's like, make this stop. And she's crying. Obviously, uh, probably because of those monsters everywhere and crap.
Okay. second but we gotta go unlock that place we're gonna go unlock real quick uh, which is this the store and we're gonna go save that we did that all right um let's do it Some outsider missionary. <laughs> Your rotten corpse will serve my mistress well. Mm. I would use this. This is the tainted missive, but uh, it temporarily increases the attack by 100% at the cost of HP, but we don't need to use that. We got other stuff we can use instead. How about the violet sprite? Which is like the blessing charm, but different. It's got purple stuff floating around you. Oh, yes. Uh -huh. So yeah, I got to this point a little bit earlier, and I was just like, man, this sucks. And then I checked out my first file. I was like, oh my goodness, I already have all the items. And I'm at the same spot I was at, so let's just do it this way. Okay, maybe I already used that. Or maybe you can't get the fairy right now? I can't remember. Whatever. Existence elsewhere. You little pest. I can't waste any more time with you. Bye. If I'm not mistaken, I think you may have to fight her a second time later, but I can't remember. Let's keep going. Hello again. But not really again, because you're just a different version of the same monster we saw earlier, and I'm dead. If you use this and try to attack this... Oh, never mind. Well, yeah. It's, uh, the, the thingies around you there will we'll just hit that. Let's see if I can, uh... Get anything that'll help us with fighting these monsters over here. Try this, I guess. Okay. That was cool. Yeah, I haven't played this in a long time, like I said, so a lot of the animations and what these things do, I don't really remember. Completely. Hello. What are you looking at? I'm human like you. Oh, this one. You don't seem very capable of protecting yourself. Take my word and look for shelter. Okay. My name is Kath. I'm a knight. I'm a knightess in service of the kingdom. So, you're a priestess from Loon, and you're seeking the queen's aid? Ha ha ha. You think she has inter any interest in your little village? Well, here's some bad news. 
I heard rumors of an undead witch lurking around. Progressing deeper into the city is very risky. If you are adamant about meeting with the queen, my advice only goes so far. Are you talking about Lubella who I just defeated? Probably. Okay. It's nothing, nothing. Oh no. Hmm. What's up here? Clarity shard makes everything brighter when you're in a dark area. Very convenient, obviously. Sealed wind, cast wind sorcery. specific item to be able to go down there and back that we don't actually have right now even though we're playing with mostly I guess mostly items we have unlocked but there's a couple you need to get I think uh, I need to go check back and check that other area the royal court has been ignoring the royal court has been ignoring us citizens ever since this kingdom fell the curse so if you want to stay safe don't leave outside Okay, we'll come back this way. Oh boy. Damn it. I hate that you can get hit while you're using these items. This is the second area, or the third area actually, not the area we were going to go to. Finally out of a cell. It should be safe here. This place seems completely abandoned. 
Now, which way was the forest again? Huh? What's with those clothes? Who are you? Identify yourself now. She's telling her who she is. Priestess? Okay then. Here's a friendly warning. You won't find safety in this region anymore. According to hearsay, the queen summoned a storm of disease from her castle, one that's spreading throughout the world. Look, you don't seem like a bad person. Please run away from here and save yourself while you still can. Okay. Subterranean grave. Guess we can't get whatever was in there. <laughs> it's Asborn. Hey, Kaho, help me somehow. Please, you must find a way to get me from the cell. Some sort of spell is spreading from this kingdom to the lands of the west. Oh, my people, please don't not leave me alone here. Okay. here and food for all my hope was lost. <coughs> now I can resume my search for my wife. We both died long ago, yet it seems the dead have crossed the border towards this world. There's much left untold. I plan to reunite with her and escape this forsaken city. I can see you are still in one piece. The kind of attire you use. That's not something from this land, am I correct? No matter. At this state of decay, none of us should be idling carelessly. I'll be around. Take care. Oh no, I can rescue this guy. Some sort of spell is spraying from this game that I was telling my people. Yeah, I'm sorry. I was only able to rescue one of you guys. Apparently. Oh right, we have the clarity shard. Or not. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, crap. So don't get hit by those things that were flying. They look like bats because they will uh, curse you. Well, unfortunately, we're not going to be able to get uh, certain treasure chests, I guess. <laughs> but they probably have money or something. Which, obviously, I don't need. Uh, but whatever. Wait, what was over to the right? Okay, well, let's go this way. die, I better find a save point. Because if you die, obviously you have to go all the way back to the last bell you hit. And we're, that would be very inconvenient right now. We're gonna go this way. Oh look, my blessing charm helped out. Uh, last one. For now. I think I kind of, yay, we found it. Okay. Um, I think I'm going to end this episode here, just because suspense and yada yada yada, etc. 
Thanks for watching this episode of Momodora with me, Sakamoto. Um, see you guys again in the next one. Love you guys. Have a great... Hello everybody, it is I, Sakamoto, here with more Momodora for you guys. Yay. Alright. Oh yeah, I'm all happy hippie G day and I'm just like wee and then we go here and it's like <laughs> This could be a meme or something. Holy crap. How do I use this item again? Oh yeah. Alright. I was playing on easy mode. Now I'm playing on normal mode, but it might as well be like super hardcore easy mode. I'm just kidding. Oh crap, I need a crystal seed. Can't see a damn thing down here. I can't see a damn thing down here. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Yubity yubity yabity bobity. Okay. That's why I like that. Uh, we can use. Uh, pocket sensory. I think that might be one of the things the bee spider sells you. I'm not sure. Is there a way to get up here? Okay. Oh, hell no. Um, so here, like, long range weapon, long range weapon. Oh, yeah, that's right. I don't need that money. There's nothing up here? Oh, maybe there was, and I already got it. But wouldn't there be an empty treasure chest? Whatever! Nothing apparently. Oh wait. Nope, still nothing. Okay. Let's go. Oh boy. do that to enemies. Normally they don't affect them like that. They just are still able to like not get flinched and attack them and stuff. Oh boy. Oh yeah. We're all those mini versions of that minion guy we fought before. Mocha I think his name was. Do you mean that? No, the money's gone and my clarity shard. Is now no longer a thing. Oh crap, I think I have to let him explode that wall. I don't know if I have anything that can do that. Hey little buddy, you wanna explode this wall for me? Oh crap. Come on, I'm right here. Oh, uh, he hit the blessing charm. There we go. Good job. Thanks, little buddy. Alright, now I think we can get the bell over here. Yes. Um... I hate that I can only use that one time. Can I even buy anything from you? No. What's this do? Yeah. Okay. I'm resetting the timer. What is over here? Hello again. I think we were over here, right? Damn. Dumb flower. Come to me. Yeah, that's the prison over there, right? 
Why are you still here? You've been free this whole time. Hello? You okay? Oh crap. Okay, so... I'm trying to remember where I need to go next. I think I know. Die! Ah, shit. No! That's not money. What do you mean that's not money? Oh, not this way. Remember those uh, saw blades in the water? I think that's where we gotta go. First we're gonna go up into the left from here. There we go. How dare you! You smack me with your giant lamp thingy. This lady, uh, she will throw that thing at you um, while you're trying to fight the boss over here. Yeah, we're about to fight the fight a boss. Sorry, I didn't mention that yet. Uh, yeah, let me figure out. No, not that. The violet sprite. Okay. You can use these uh, in conjunction with with each other. These are uh, protective charms. Uh, what was I gonna use? Equip. Let's get the uh, bell flower here. Here the heavy arrows and the poison arrows too actually can help out a lot. They'll deplete his health when they poison him. He's dead now. I don't know if there's any other patterns he does. Um, sorry if I skipped out on them. <laughs> but hey, we killed the boss. Uh, oh, and you got this for beating him, which. And a crust fragment. It's, it's essence grants you the ability to charge arrows faster. I think the crust fragments are something you get. Oh uh, yeah, and they actually do unlock the thing after you've already beaten the game before. So there are some things like that, and uh, the thing you get that allows you to um, be smaller and get into areas easier, um, but you don't get in a replay right up right at the beginning. In case you're wondering about that, or in case I didn't mention it before. I know I mentioned about the thing that makes you smaller, I think. Alright. I still need to find my way to that one spot. Which isn't this way. I need to go back. Uh, oh crap. I'm an idiot. 
well, that just killed our one hit. Okay. another key I think for this that door we were at earlier or we can only open it from one side I can't remember exactly but we'll find out at some point probably now we need to go this way Whee! I'm swimming by jumping I can breathe in water forever. That's, how, that's what priestesses can do in this universe, apparently. Yeah, plot armor. Times infinity, basically. This is not question it. Let's just enjoy ourselves. I think those things kill you in one hit. But I didn't want to deal with them earlier. But I forgot. You kind of have to, I think. Not 100%. This might just be something optional. We're gonna find out. Oh. Not optional. I think this is my favorite song in the game. Did I miss anything in that last area? I don't think I did. I think we're good. for anything. Okay, these things fall, I'll be careful here.
Here's a pal near here. Maybe? game will give you that at this point if you didn't kill the first boss and without getting hit. Okay, boss is here. We're gonna come back. Check out the rest of the area first. For me, there's probably something there. You're playing this for the first time. Totally meant to do that. Thanks, Blessing Charm. That was probably an important thing to do, actually. <laughs> There's a new monster over here, yeah. This thing, uh, obviously spreads seeds from its head. It fall down and can hit you. Poisonous. That's cool. something there, I don't know. Go over there. There's a lot of stuff I'm doing where they probably already did the thing. <laughs> famous for that and Potter Puffer Pals. 
How are we going back here? Well, there's this person I wanted to meet somewhere around this area. Insect species, a kind of ivory bug. If you happen to come across one of those, please bring it to me. I will reward you any way I can. It seems you have around 20 of those ivory bugs here. They are small, but provide my plants with necessary nutrients. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for bringing me all those bugs. Okay. So I guess I already have the thing that she gives you, which I think is the Passiflora. Okay. Cool. Now I can get in another car city. No. Don't attack on me. I attack you. <laughs> I wanna see if uh crap. I can get through that one door, but I don't think I can with the garden key. I think you need a different key for that. Yeah, let's just go back to the main plot anyways. Which is the boss, so we're gonna go do that now. Because all I really wanted to do was see that lady and make sure I didn't have to worry about the RV bugs, which obviously I don't. I mean, I think I would have found at least one by now. I gotta hit that switch again in order to go that way. So. But I already went that way before. But I wanna go that way again just to make sure everything is in ship shop shape. those areas won't be available to you right off the bat so you'll have to explore if you want your map to be complete even if there's nothing over there for some reason but I think there is there, there's definitely usually not a reason not a not reason to go places right damn okay goodbye Here we go. Boss time. Okay, we gotta fight this lady again. No, 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 no. Did I just die? I was looking away from the screen for a second. Uh, okay. 
I guess I, that's one of those automatic plot deaths. Uh, so now I'm a cat, obviously. Can't use items when you're a cat. But you can still hit the bell. And use your leaf. And now you can run fast. And this is the form you take when you want to get to those smaller areas. By the time you complete this area, you'll get an item that allows you to turn into a cat whenever you want. That's what I was talking about earlier. <coughs> okay, we'll come back, because I want to see what's over here. There's an ivory back there. Wait, that's where we need to go to exit, but I wasn't done exploring. I guess I was gonna explore. Okay. Yeah, that's the cat spirit. That that's what allows you to do that. And it's the only item you can use as a cat. Okay, we killed the boss. We got the cat sphere. Tune in next time for the next area of this game. This is going by pretty quick. I think we're like already halfway, if not more than half, a little bit more than halfway through the game. So, yep. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Have a great. Hello, everybody. This is I, Sakamoto. Here we go with more Momodora. We got the cat sphere last time and I just got hit by something. You know what? Let's go and use the cat sphere. Oh wait, we don't really need to. I mean, we can though. Wait, what's over here? Okay, we're not going through there. Oh crap, I think I have to sneeze. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, and burp. How rude of me. Hold on, there should be a way to get where we want to go by going this way, hopefully. Can you, like, stop with the bomb throwing me in? Can't you see I'm busy trying to think about other stuff right now? Okay, we don't need the cats here right now. Let's put that instead. And hopefully not get hit. Alright. Oof, what's down here? Okay, I think I remember you guys. Yeah, we're here again, okay. Bowie, stop hitting me. I'm an innocent girl, don't you know? Uh, this way maybe? Hey, it's this guy. My dear Cecilia. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Okie dokie. Goodbye, Ascorn. See you later. I guess he got out of the jail cell somehow magically. I wonder if I went back there if he would still be there. It's a little bit plot holy right there. Did we go that way? Or I think we did. Yeah, we did. Yibbity 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 yabbity. Alright. Um, that's a pass for a lady. Okay. So we could totally. Ow. There's monsters here. No, get up there. Hit her. There you go. I 
decide if I should go explore those other areas. Oh, we got the cat sphere, we can do this. Uh, I don't even know if we can get anything out from down there. Peace. Yeah, I think it's an ivory bug or something. Or the thing that makes your leaf green. Probably that. How you doing, lady? I just killed you as a cat. What do you think about that? Uh, I rhymed. Lol. Screw you guys. I'm shooting arrows at you. The main thing I was worried about when we finished the subterranean great grave was we hadn't gotten in contact with her at that some point. At that point. I'm glad you were still alive. I guess I didn't introduce myself last time. My name is Ari. Nice to meet you. So you came here from the west. Hmm, anywhere would be safer than here. This city is our people have become shapeless, aimless ghosts. We were left here to die, don't you think? No. Ah, thank you. Your words give me hope. I'm retreating to the bordering forest. That area is protected from the Queen's curse. Alrighty. I'm going there too, but only to check out cats for areas. Now we're gonna walk all the way back. Wait a minute. I just realized you run a lot faster as a cat. <sighs> Hello, Mr. Dead. Caterpillar. Giant caterpillar. Thingy. Halfway morphed into a butterfly. Okay. Uh. Okay. I sneezed. And I don't have any tissues. Wait. Never mind, we're good. I found a tissue. Oh crap. No! What the heck is over here? I totally forgot. Oh no. Ah, can I transform? Okay, good. Just wondering if this area made it so you couldn't transform. But I am look ghosty looking now, so that's a thing. Okay, cool. Well, looks like I came here for no reason. Oh yeah, not only can you run fast, do you run faster as a cat, you also jump a lot farther. It's probably good to know, right? Okay. Well, this is like a whole ass area. Okay. Oh great. No, 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 no. Are you kidding me? I have to face you? Oh, come on. Run faster. Jump higher. I threw it on the ground. <laughs> I don't need your energy drink, man. Oh, here we go. Good. I didn't come here for no reason. Its essence it grants you the ability to warp when praying. Okay, good. Now we don't have to worry about running, walking all the way back to where, wherever. Basically. Oh, 
Okay, good, 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 good. So you can warp to certain places from any bell that you find now once you get that. So, yeah. I knew there was a good reason to go down there. Over here, dummy. Oh, crap. Okay, there's a thing up here, I think. And then there's like one or two other areas. Okay, this just takes you over here. Got it. Oh, maybe I should go try talking that one imp girl as a cat. I think they're like imps or whatever. Hello, Ugu. That's your name. Your name is Ugu now, because that's what you say when you come down. Uh, oh, I think you can get up there as a cat and get something, maybe, I don't know. It's a little bit tricky, though. Yeah, nope. 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 I'm gonna try it a few times. If I don't get it, I'll give it up. Yeah, there we go. Okay, well, there might be an ivory bug or something up here for you guys that I already got, apparently. So check that out if you get a chance. Can't remember if we've unlocked anything over here at this point. I know there's this guy. Don't hit me, I'm just a kitty. I'm just an innocent little kitty cat who can run really fast like most cats, but also jump extremely high unlike most cats. So I'm completely normal, obviously. Can we even go back up here? Crap. Wait, no, we can use a bell maybe. That was cool. Uh, nope, uh, whatever, that was cool, you're like a cat and a lady at the same time, I have been pizzle-oisened, oh no, uh, goodbye, Crizzlelap. This person. Um, they're all happy now, but they're not talking to me. Okay, bye bye. Uh, nope, nothing down here. I think you're already exploring this area. How do you go through this game and get a pacifist um, ending or whatever? I just can't see it. I think I decided what game I'm playing after this. I won't tell you what it is, though. It's a surprise. Surprise is all. But I will say that it's not Sonic Mania, but I think I figured out a way to be able to play that and record it, so that's on the horizon as well. Probably. Oh, well, maybe it will be Sonic Mania. 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 Shit, so I'm gonna die. Uh, maybe my kitty's cat's here. I'm sick of running slow. Uh, I can't climb as a cat. Get me out of here! Holy crap. I can stop knives with my green blade. I think. Don't think you can do it with the red one. Uh, well, I haven't. Tried, I don't even know if I tried it with the red one or not. I can't remember. All right, let's go this way. 
Uh, wait a minute. Okay, we are able to go back this way. Sacred or Dahlia Grove? Or Dahlia Grove? That's the name of this area? I knew that. I was say I should probably do something, but then I was gonna, like, say something that would be like breaking the fourth wall or something, but whatever. Let's not worry about that. Well, you want to say it anyways. You guys are that curious? I'm gonna say I should rename my first episode from Beginnings to Sacred or Dahlia Grove. Okay. Um, can I just get up here? Thanks. Like, why do you gotta be standing right there making me get hit? Just so I could go back and see if there's a kitty cat spot around here. Which I don't think there is. Come on. Once we go back to that bell, we'll warp to, uh, where we need to go. We're just going all the way back to the beginning, just to be on the safe side. Oh, hey, look. This is an area. <laughs> Alright. Isn't this game just so freaking beautiful, guys? It's such a good game. I think it's gonna have a sequel coming out pretty soon, if it's not out already. Uh, yeah, I think you play as a different character, if I'm not mistaken, than Kaho here. I think it's another priestess from somewhere else land, but whatever. Owie! I'm, so, I'm definitely going to play it for sure. Kitty cat time. I'm a cute little kitty cat. Alright, back here. That's a cat. Alright. I wish we went back to Car City. I think that's actually where we need to be, not here. Hmm, let me check them out. We're going like over there in the center, I think. And if we go to Car City, we'll be like over in this area where that first bell on the far left is, I think. Or maybe that one. Uh, yeah, let's go check that out. Yeah, I knew it. over here. Okay, well that's not that bad. No, you cannot get me today, lady. Which lady, specifically? Uh-huh. You've been a bad boy. <laughs> no! Apparently I've been a bad boy, too. <laughs> no, we don't want to be here. Uh, I fell into some spikes and I died and now I'm back here again. Yippity doopity doppity shoopity wappity shoppity hoppity. Really? Uh, I see how it is. Okay. Not that way. This way, maybe? And to the right? Although I got here from... Whatever. Hmm. Whatever. I think that rock can hurt you, but apparently not the enemy. That's fair. Oh no.
yeah, we definitely would have got here anyways from Memorial Park. But hey, this is okay. This is where we need to be. Well, the car has been ignoring us. Oh, car, of course. It's been ignoring us citizens ever since this kingdom fell to a curse. If you want to stay safe, don't leave outside. What am I thinking about grocery shopping here? Don't call me any closer. Question mark? Oh well, you seem sane enough. You are a priestess seeking audience with the royal court? In the present state, reaching the castle is highly difficult. You won't find help easily in this city, but my master might be able to guide you. She lives inside this city's monastery, surrounded by cats. Yeah, that's where we're going. A neophyte? Do you seek salvation? Question mark. You can achieve salvation from eternal damnation by donating to St. Esselin. Recommendation of at least 15 monies is needed for that. Okay, sure, why not? We are thankful. We may find peace. Better give him money just in case. I don't want to have eternal damnation. Here, I'll even give you more. Okay, thanks. Bye. We are small. We are a small minority now that her that the her highness propagated her destruction. Most of the population has lost faith in the gods. She's to blame for all that's wrong right now. Well, that's sad. Saint Islan is absolute. His wish reigns supreme. You are safe here with us. What did you say? Ta ta ta. Got it. Is there a bell around here? I'll use a clarity shot. Oh, this lady. What's up, lady? Our prayers have been heard. The witch of decay and her demons have been vanquished. Little by little, the voice of the gods pierces through this kingdom shrouded in darkness. I think she's talking about Lubella. Yeah. Novella the Witch of Decay. Still, for this convent to go against Her Highness's wishes, it is a disgrace to the name of our Lord. Her kindness show knows no bounds. If you so desire, she'll protect even a heretic from loon such as you. Hello, I'm the one that killed the Witch of Decay, and apparently the one that God sent, according to you. So, you know what? Why can't I tell her that? Whatever. Oh no, these those skull things. Do this, obviously. Oh boy. I'll just stand here and let the curse fade away, I guess. So I can go down and check this out as a kitty cat. Which I think it's probably just an ivory bug, but I'm gonna see if there's a hidden room or whatever. I'm going so slow. Okay. can shoot these guys. But they explode and leave the curse. But not nearly as long as poison lasts, so that's kinda good. Oh crap, I forgot about these exploding barrels. And a witch you can't see. Ugh. I wanted to go explore other places around here. Give me a second. Nope, nope, no, 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 no. Yeah! Damn it. No stupid curses. No, I got killed. I'm just a little kitty cat. Damn it. <laughs> okay, we're going up this time. Then we'll go down. Oh, it's an elevator. Elevator. Doesn't go very high. That's kind of good because that's less crap I gotta deal with. Okay. Pretty lady painting.
Uh, okay. Have it your way. This is BK. Spikes down there, don't go down there. Holy crap, hello. I'm just gonna not fight you. How about them apples? Oh look, a bell. It just drops a bunch of money. We go through here, we can just poison ourselves instead. Exploring this way gets you. Unless there's like a boss fight we haven't unlocked yet that way. Looks there might be, I can't remember. Maybe the boss fight is this way. Bachman. We need a key. Come on, man. Can't we all just get along? We gotta fight. Don't you know I'm just an innocent little priestess lady? Okay, hello again, Mr. Curse Guy. Holy shiz. Another locked door. Oh, what was that? I mean, there was a treasure chest there, but apparently we already got that. So, get it on your way down here if you haven't gotten it yet. Uh, okay. Now we're here. Hey, this is probably where the keys are that we need. I hope. Okay. Here's an ivory bug around this area. Uh, I think right, right up in there or something. Or like over there maybe? Oh yeah, yeah right here you can get an ivory bug I think, that's how you get it. It's one of the ones I had to like look up and find with the internet. No, I said no. What the heck? here again. Interesting. I need to know where this connects to. We'll get to a spot where we've been before in a second here probably. Maybe I died down here. Just came down here and I was like, oh this is nothing. Okay. And then I just didn't explore. Oh. It's this area again. I think. I don't know. Okay, I remember this now. I need a bell. I mean, I got the passive floors, but still. Alright, let's go back. Yeah, that's... Okay, I remember now. Did we go, were we down here before? Is this 
that's where it came from, I think it might be. Uh huh. Well then, I see how it is. Okay. Alright. This is new. Sort of. Okay. Okay, they're like Mario Phillips. Locked door. You can go this way. This thing is so heavy and powerful that the drilling arrows don't go through. Should be getting close to a bell, I would think. Okay. Mm-hmm. Hello. Uh, the red ring restores a small HP to kill, but enemies don't drop money. And there's another ring of candor here. You only need to get one of each. Once you have them, obviously, you don't need to buy them again, and the game won't let you. Because you already have them. Uh... Well, that happened. gonna stand here and heal myself for a second. Skip ahead a little bit. if you have both of these equipped. Not regular arrows though. Kinda. We're still on drop money. Interesting. There's the bell. There's a boss over there. We still need keys. At least one key. I think it might actually be around here. We'll go back that way in a second. <sighs> Yeah, this is one of the keys, I believe. Where one of the keys is. So 
sweet. Might be the only one we need. I don't know. I have so much health that the spikes didn't kill me. Surprisingly. Come on. the boss. Well, I think she helps you with the boss. We 
did it. Yay. <sighs> Thank you for your assistance. Are you hurt? It's my first time seeing a sacred leaf in action. Certainly an interesting way of fighting off enemies. Since you're still around, perhaps you'll hear me out. Sure. Good. I suspected something was amiss up there at the castle. The queen I once served was noble and caring, but now she's turned into a morbid figure. Anything under her direct control is lost, so I've deserted her order of knights. Here's my proposal, taking down the queen. You mentioned her curses reached your homeland. Should you choose to side with me, you are going to need a special crest. We split into four pieces. One of its fragments should be around here. Once you have the four parts, head to the locked door at the entrance of the city. Okie dokie, artichokey. What is over here? Okay, that's one of the fragments. I know we got at least two, but that might be the last one. What? Oh, cool. Okay. So that was a thing. Damn it, damn it. that key I think we need to go explore a little bit more okay we got three press fragments yeah all right oh and this is the leaf you unlock uh, where is it key item green leaf blessed by a sacred tea able to purify those corrupted by the curse Especially if it contains stronger repelling powers than the common maple leaves. Okay. Oh, this is the guy. What one am I? I guess I bought everything from him already. The impurity flask. Restores HP whenever you use this poison. Or her candor. And it's a sign of secrecy. Drilling arrows. Arrows speaks to her enemies. I think the drilling arrows are what you can buy from him. Uh, and not get anywhere else. If I'm not mistaken. And maybe even the impurity flask. There's a place we can use a key over here. Just night. No. Oh, 
Okay, there's a switch there. Interesting. Don't know what it does, but we're gonna find out. And over there. those things aren't coming down anymore? Interesting. Well, I can remember the other door that needs a key to go through it. Was it left? Or this way? Switch was a booby trap. This place is a little confusing, to be honest. I don't know what's going on here. Okay, we're back here. Again. Hang on. I think there was an area where we had to put a key in something we didn't put it into. And those yellow ones are annoying. Also... Okay. down there. Oh no, we don't want to be here. You know what? Screw it. We got all the items. There's not going to be a crest fragment. It's going to be after the next boss. Ugh. Okay. left is what brought us to where we were just at and wound up dying. Or not. There is nothing over there. Okay. Back to the bell. There's nothing over here, right? I don't think so. Yeah, there's nothing over there. Okay. What the heck? No. Not where we want to go yet. No. Oh my goodness. I just need a bell. Okay, never mind. Yeah, that's the bell we want. Okay. Wait a minute. This is where we were earlier. 
There's nothing over here. Unless there's something over here I'm missing. I think I already went this way. Yeah. Well, that works. Uh, I think we're gonna go this way then. Alright guys, that's gonna be it for this episode. Thanks for watching. Tune in next time where we fight another boss <laughs> and get to that boss and everything else. So, thanks for watching. Have a great. Hello, everybody. It is I, Sakamoto. Back with more Momodora. Yee. Hold on a second. Sorry. Okay. There we go. Uh, okay, I didn't get cursed. Somehow, magically. I can't remember. Was there anything important this way? Fart knocker. Hello. I have a Beavis and Butthead soundboard. I might use it at some point while I'm playing. Not, maybe, probably not this game, but I don't know, we'll see. Okay, this is somewhere we have not been. Good, I'm fast enough as a human that I don't have to worry about that. Hello, shopkeeper. Okay, we don't need to buy it because we already have it. Apparently. Uh, oh. Can't you see I'm a girl? Why would you attack a girl? Hello. If it isn't an unfamiliar face to this monastery, I developed from Moon. I see. You can call me Cotillard. Oh? You have met with par Paramol? Kick, kick, kick. Such innocence. So, you are concerned about your homeland. Indeed, the darkness assaulting your people hails from here. Our queen has become possessed by malevolent greed. She's the one responsible for many casualties, not only here, but in other lands, too. Kick, kick, kick. Perhaps you should head to the castle. Don't expect kindness from those who live there. You'll have to find a way on your own. Here, this should help you a bit. Cool, thanks, I needed that. Be careful. Best be careful! <laughs> it's It's been only a year since all of this started, but most of our population is completely degenerated. Look at all the cute kitties. Hey look, I'm a cat too. Hello? Can't see me? Okay. Oh, I guess there's nothing this way. Let me go this way. Maybe we can get up there. Whatever. I am not fighting you guys again. No, that it looks like I have to for some reason. Hey, we gotta hit the bell. What the heck? Talk. Welcome to the development room. Congratulations on making it this far. This is where you get to meet the development team. If you wish to go back, proceed to the left. Oh, I think you get this if you beat the game. Hello. I hope you're enjoying Momodora, Ardain. Whatever we make next, I hope you look forward to it too. PKBT. Oh, my developer room coat. I haven't thought of one yet. 
Ardeen says I need a vacation. I guess I could say that. I guess I could say that, Hernan. You can achieve anything as long as you believe in it. Don't give up, my friend. See you again in the future. What the heck? Dot 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 dot. Notorious name. Boo! Okay, I guess that's it. Thorns. I didn't do anything for this game. Okay. Alright, developers. See you later. Really? Alright then. Dang, it's dark in here. Yeah. What? There's nothing up here. Impossible. What the heck? Okay, what did they even come over here for then? Maybe I come from up there and then I can come down this way and go elsewhere, I'm guessing? Whatever. Okay, I got the monastery key. I guess that's all I really need from that area. Now I know where that witch is. What's that? I don't even know what I was about to say. Dodd, darn it. I'm already cursed. I don't need you cursing me too. Wish this curse would go away. I got more important things to worry about. <clears throat> um. I think we've already been this way before, but whatever. Yeah, I remember. Well, I have the key now. Maybe I can use it. Over here, put something. No, my clarity shard ran out. Hello. No. Oh, this is where that frickin' giant bell is. Other than that, I don't think there's anything else. Okie dokie then. This is new. Okay, we'll come back to this. I think there's one more thing I want to check out that I may have already checked out, but I don't remember. Oh yeah, the downstairs of this area down here, I think. Okay. This. Uh, okay. Yeah. This. Okay. I got. I got a key now, but I guess it doesn't matter for that. 
Was this the cinder chambers? I'm gonna be going all the way back up there again. Great. Wait, is there a bell nearby? Can you just teleport? Left, left, down, right. Okay. Okay, we're back here again, but I kind of, I think I know where to go. Yeah, this way. Was it this way? No, it was up here. I think. Or was it down there? No. I don't think it's down here. Okay, okay, Choki. The place we were able to use a key. Oh yeah, I think it's this way. What the heck? You're gonna hit me again, aren't you? Nope. Artificial healing zone. Guess I didn't have that before. Oh, okay. Cool. Oh, that's super useful. Okay. I guess it's boss time. The, the queen destroyed this kingdom's faith. This convent, our abode, is all that's left for those who pray. Maiden in white, you are not one of us. Sorry, I'm using my normal voice for a woman. Perhaps you have sided with the queen. Look at what she's done to this kingdom. Oh no, she has a sword. It is my duty to expurge that evil. Uh, okay. to me again. Really? Can't even... I'm just gonna use... Uh...
even with the artificial healing zone, we died. Which makes it useless. I'm getting a bell after getting cursed. Takes the curse away. gonna cast a bunch of offensive magic then we'll put some defense on ourselves with the blessing charm and the violet sprite. We're gonna try that to see if it works. First thing we'll break out of again is the fairy we get by pressing up up down left right. Come on. Come on, they just what the heck man? I'm overpowered. I shouldn't be having to deal with. Oh wow, my arrows are just destroying her. Guess I don't have to do anything else. Must be because I'm using heavy arrows now, or something. I don't know. Why, my lord? Well, you attacked and I defended. Hey, look, a crest fragment. You found a crest fragment. It's doesn't grant you the ability to a new bow charge level. Oh, hells yeah, man. Cool. And that's it. We got all the quest fragments, meaning we can go onward with our day. To the, the, the one area we need to go to. It's the end of the game, basically. Oh, heck. Oh, wait, there's a bell. We can just warp. Get me out of here! The end of the game is where we're gonna go. You are not a nice lady. Attacking a poor innocent priestess girl like me. How dare you! Get here. Get out, outsider, now. You're giving me the creeps. This is the Royal Pinacothica, I think. That's what it said. Right? Pinacothica. Yeah, that's the word. We got it. We got them, boys. Let's go. The heck are these? Holy crap! Hello. Okay. Got little mini versions of that boss we fought earlier. At the subterranean cave. Okay. No. No, wrong button. I don't want to go back to the bell just to... Blessing charm. Yes, sir. Didn't kill him one hit, huh? I see. Yep. Okay. No. No, that, screw that. I want to go down here anyways. You know what that means? I have to fight my way back up to that area. What the heck that noise was outside? Whatever. 
I got headphones on, so I don't care. What? Oh, who are you? Someone from the southern provinces? Prov prov provinces? There's a certain peculiar air around you. Please join us here. It's safer, though. It may seem you can manage. It seems you can manage your way around. That's like a, a song, or maybe even the theme song from the original Momodora. Why is that door there? If I can just do this. Oh, so they can be safe, it's for them. Alright, so there's no reason to go that way. I mean, there was the hidden room with the music. Kind of an Easter egg, I guess. For you know, hardcore fans of the series and whatnot. All right, let's fight this. Oh, well, I don't need to because I can't go up there. I need to go this way. Oh heck! I need a. This will work. Oh my gosh, it didn't work. Alright, we got a bell. Hex, yeah. the paintings? Damn paintings! Oh great. Well, hopefully there's nothing important over here. Oh come on. Yeah, I know, right? I love how she can be bored and yawn while she's doing this. It's hilarious. Okay. Remember the paintings. They will attack you once you get up here. Unless... Oh, there's one painting, but I guess one comes from below. Jumping sword attacks pretty damn useful. Okay. I think when you need to get that opening to do so, we need to hit all three of those things. In succession. Got it. But there's also a room down there, which we'll check out after we go this way. Okay, probably that page going to attack us, I'm assuming. Yep. Oh, interesting. Okay. Shit. Okay, let's go straight down. Ba 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 
Like, what do, what do, what do, what do, what do, 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 Wait a minute. Can't even interact with it as a cat. No. Okay. Well, that was a waste of time. Apparently. Well, no, because now we got this way we can go through. Paintings. I remember this area being a lot harder. Oh yeah, probably because I didn't have these items that I have now. But I did have a lot of items at this point. From, you know, beating all the bosses beforehand. But I don't know if I had the Blessing Charm. I think you might get that for beating the Queen without getting hit. Which took me a really long time and it was really frustrating when I did it. Oh no, I'm lost. No, I'm not. I, I have one way I can go. There we go. Okay. Remember the area up here, kind of? Okay, I don't think I've been over there on the right. Oh, that's probably the area where you can sort of not get to right now. Because it doesn't, it doesn't, the door that doesn't open from the side that we were on is where that area was, I think, with the little duck bird thingies. Purple duck bird thingies. Yeah. That's what they are. keys in here. I have a feeling that might be. I mean, where else can we go? This is the last area we can get to. out, probably. I don't think I've tried going this way yet. No, I have not. And down there is the area I was probably talking about. Okay. Frickin' paint frickin' paintings. I love how you can still attack me while I'm attacking you. That's how I died before. <laughs> Screw your painting. Okay, let's do this. This time we're gonna try going down. See what's down there. Perfect timing.
know, this is the place. Okay, so they can only hit you if they're like a certain a certain part of their swing. Hmm. Okay. Got that area unlocked. That door. Rather. Okay, I think it's boss time, but. I don't have a bell near here. Oh boy. So you are the one who engaged with Fennel. Turn back now, for her highness does not want to be disturbed. Such impudence. Magnolia!
Okay. We'll make that mistake again. Dum-dum me is a dum-dum. <laughs> Where's the other thing? No. Oh, yeah, that's something. Sorry. I know you're kind. <laughs> I just said, <laughs> just like the part where you stand against our queen, <laughs> blinded by faith. The queen would never hurt us. What the heck? Okay, this is the last area then, I guess. 
I can't go back up there. Unless I reset the game. I guess we could do that. Oh, I thought this was the end, but I guess not. Or that the other area was the end. What the heck's over here? Okay. We just gonna die if we go down here? Okay, good to know. I think there was some stuff I still may not have explored in the world kind of close like that. No? Oh yeah, that upper area, I think I died at it. I'm gonna go warp over there. Check that out, and then that'll probably be it for this episode. We can come back here, right? I hope so. No. Oh well, we'll just have to run back there and save then. Yeah, I guess you can dodge and stuff. And you know, once you have this. It's a lot easier to get around enemies, so maybe that's if this is possible. Just really, 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 really hard. Obviously. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is where we want to go. What a cool slash, buddy. Yeah, I thought it was cool. No, painting! Do not attack me, you are a painting! How are you moving that slow and able to hurt me? Video game logic. Dang it, man. where we want to go. Frick. What the frick? No, I'm not dealing with going all the way back through the... That works. <laughs> Alright, remember, crumbling floor. Need to get past the crumbling floor. I'm not even gonna be anything up there, except nothing for me, because I already have everything for the most part. But, I did find that soft tissue thing, and I didn't, apparently didn't have before, so who knows? I way to know is to explore. Okay, crumbling floor, no well, thank you. Oh my goodness, can I just to just do what I need to do? I'm, I know I'm trying to rush and I'm freaking Oh my gosh I'll Stop rushing then, okay fine You'll get there when you get there to do it apparently. Uh, no! No there is not! Just kill me.
kill everything. The only way I know how to get things done, apparently. Really? This is Maybe there's an ivory bug. I don't know, guys. But it looks like I got up, came up here for no reason. Well, now I know. That's what the scientists mean when they say even failures can be successes. Because now you know what not to do. That is not a cat sphere. This way, or you're gonna die. Lol. Can't believe you can't warp to the entrance of Car's Castle. Maybe there's probably another bell you can warp to in that area, but whatever. Don't worry about it later. About it at all. Okay, guys, that's gonna be it for this episode of Sakamoto's Let's Play of Momodora Reverie into the Moonlight. Hopefully, you enjoyed me getting frustrated and dying a lot. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Love you guys. See you in the next one. More, more, mo, me, me, mo, mo, more, mo, I sound like a Scottish person trying to say purple burglar alarm. More Momodora on the way. More Momodora on the horizon. Have a great... Hey everybody, it's me, Moist Critical, aka Penguin Zero, aka Charlie. Um, I'm here with more of this game, Momodora, Referee Under the Moonlight. Nah, I'm just kidding. It's, uh, it's, it's not Moist Critical, it's... Top of the morning to you, laddies. My name is Jack Septicai, and welcome back to more Moment. <laughs> no, no, no. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, the, no. The, it's um. Hey, how's it going, bros? My name is Peter. Pa no, wait. <laughs> Hello, everybody. My name is Mark Clyde. Welcome back to. <laughs> wait, no, that was really bad for um everybody that I just tried to do an impression of. Okay, let's just get into the game. Hello, everybody. It is I, Sakamoto. <laughs> okay. It's more Momodora. <laughs> Lol. Oh no, I got hit. Oh, it's like a hidden room, but I guess it's not. Oh, I need the clarity shard. Dang it. Clarity shard. There it is. That didn't do anything. Red. No, not that one. What the heck is this crud? Oh no. Oh no, that is a lot of health. Goodbye. Goodbye. Have a nice existence elsewhere. Or rather, where you already were, I guess. Are you guys really coming in the water? Uh, they just don't give any poops. Uh, well, this is kind of boring. Where's the music? Oh no. Oh, hello. Goodbye. Oh, maybe the clarity should work better there. I don't know. Oh. 
Hmm. Hello, kitty cat. Meow, welcome to Car's Castle, human. That black dress, a sacrifice made in from Loon, I presume. Meow, perhaps even your methods wouldn't be enough to save us. Did that fix the bridge? Okay, good. Now we're gonna go hit the bell real quick. Maybe we can get over that. I just love this music. I mean, it's technically a song, but it's just... Well, I can kind of hear it. There's, there's some strings in there. I'm gonna attack the thing. How the frick did this little cannon dude just take off with a bajillion HP like that? Whatever. Of course. No, you can't beat me. I'm too good. Dang it. Hello. Mr. Random guy out of nowhere. I don't remember this level at all for some reason. Maybe there's not much to it. Okay, I gotta be kitty cat now. You know, watch out for that. Just bait it into coming at you and dodge. Oh, I'm not gonna fight you. Well, that happened. No. There we go. Hm. I think the cat was just laughing at me. Dang it! Dang it, Bobby! Dang it, Bobby! I can't do King of the Hill, I can't. I can't do any impressions, I'm just bad at all of them. Really? You're like a little frickin' turtle cannon thingy. I just... How are you that strong? Right, we're gonna try going this way this time. Crumbling? No? Okay. Hey, a bell! Wasn't well, that convenient? And there's nothing here. I have to go the other way to ma maybe unlock whatever this is supposed to be. I'm getting... Wait a minute. Let's try the clarity shard. That would be really useful right now. No, not this. Did it even work? I think it worked. Oh no. I did not mean to poke the sleeping bear. Really? Okay. Alright. Use all the bell flowers. This time I was prepared. Wah ha ha! Wait, is there anything? Nope. Can't go that way. It's always nice to know that usually, no matter how far away an enemy is, you can hit them with your bow and arrow. Really? It's like it doesn't matter how high your health is. The enemies are so strong, and they can take off the same amount of, per, almost the same amount of percentage of health as they could in the beginning of the game. You know what I mean? B S. That's what that's that is. No, no. Get me out of here. 
I'm not dying here again. Yeah, you can hit me while I'm hitting you, that's fair. Same with you. Far. Oh, that's cool. I'm here to annoy you as well. Ready to use Passiflora's. I guess I got the Impurity Flask and the Rotten Bellflowers too. And a few other things like being able to kill enemies and get health and... I can create that healing zone, which I think I'm going to do that right now. Uh, I don't think it's a passive object. This could take a while. Wait, that's it? Great. That wasn't... <laughs> Give me the rotten bell flowers. Right. Hey, look at that. We can go use the bell down there. Okay, good. There's a ladder. It's boss time already. Oh, looks like it. Wow, that's a beautiful. Oh, crap. We'll, we'll be right back. I was not expecting monsters. Yes, this is Space Jam, not Momodora, didn't you know? Um. Hey, look at that. I was right about the arrows. At least. Sort of. I don't see anyone else around here. Oh gosh. No, what's, what's down here? Okay, there's a treasure chest. Anything else? Great. Don't go too fast, kitty. Okay. Maybe some ivory bugs. Alrighty. Oh! I'm freaking moving right. My finger presses down on the control stick. That's fair. How am I supposed to get back up there? Great. I'm supposed to go back this way. Big old waste of frickin' time. No. What the heck? Am I supposed to just cat leap over this? Oh, okay. Forgot we could do that. Okay. I hope there's another bell. No! Man, move! I'm pressing down on the arrow. Really? You make this freaking difficult on me? Well, it is the last level, I think. Yeah, cool. Yeah, that makes sense. Oh my goodness. Is there anything up here I can't remember? I don't even know if I went this way before. Never mind. Looks like we can't go this way.
No! What the frick, dude? What the frick? What the frick, man? I'll just turn my inputs. Hey, I made it as a human. Fucking sweet, Lois. Something back there that I had already done previously. <sighs> uh, great. Luckily for me, there's other things we can explore, I think. Didn't mean to do that. Uh, I might be lost. Maybe not. Nope, I haven't gone this way yet. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. I do deserve all that money for no reason. No. Alright. Okay, it's this woman again. my suffering. No. I was wondering why she was red, and I was like, I kind of want to fight this woman, but which lady person? But you know what? Screw that. What the heck is going on here? The uh oh. Okay, boss time. Do the arrows not work? Didn't do anything. I don't even think this is the last boss. Oh well. I guess this isn't the end yet. Okay, if you hit the wrong one, this is what happens. Not a good idea to use the blessing charm. How am I supposed to know which one's the right one? 
Okay. Sure, just keep hitting the wrong one. Oh, this is getting annoying. I don't even have a health bar. How the frick do they expect you to get up there? Really? That makes sense. Because, you know, because it has a sort of jump. Forgot about that. So I guess that was a mini boss, so we're still fighting the last boss on this level. Oh, great. Well, this is a fun elevator ride. the passive was well guys if there were any ivory bugs on this level I completely
Menge Barbie. Ton of Barbie. Somewhere between like a typical stereotypical dad voice and Beavis or Butthead. Okay, let's stand here. And Predicting that attack. Look at how much health she takes away. Finally, hell's yeah! Sorry, I'm just super excited to play the next game after this. I have no idea what just happened. <laughs> Oh, where I guess we're finding out. When the curse from east reached the village of Lynn, a priestess was sent on a sacred mission to seal it away. The priestess triumphed over the dark, stopping the spread of the curse by drawing it into her body, but she faded away in the process. Not only a faint memory of her story remains passed on as tradition. Even so, her spirit of determination lingers on, guiding young, younger priestesses towards finding peace. Oh, that's sad. Ooh, music. friend. <laughs> Ooh, 
aircraft coordinated. Cracking head. Trying to find the funny names. Obviously. Oh crap, it's going too fast. Never mind. Yuppie slime. You're welcome, game creators. That was epic. Okay, so you beat the game, it asks you if you want to save your current file. By doing so, you'll start a new journey from the beginning with some changes. Yeah, okay. Oh, look, we're back in the beginning. You get to keep most of your items, but not any of the uh, crest fragments or the cat sphere. And I don't think you get the soft tissue. Oh, you do get the soft tissue. Okay, well, I guess I didn't get it in my previous playthrough. But yeah, that's the end of Momodora, even though we're back at the beginning. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me play this, even though I kind of cheated <laughs> after episode one. Uh, Thanks so much for watching me play this game. Look forward to the next one tomorrow. Uh, I will be playing a game that is very dear to my heart. It's my favorite childhood game. I won't tell you what it is yet, but I will give you a hint. It's kind of old. <laughs> uh, I think it's from the 90s, so. All right. That's going to be it. Thanks again. Love you guys. Have a great...